Hello, my beautiful queerants. How are you? I missed you. Okay, so I had orientation today at work. It was awkward, but comfortable. I forgot not to wear jeans, and I wore jeans because I just woke up and thought about wearing jeans. And that was my fault. So now I have to go back tomorrow and apologize. But look, I got this journal, right? And I'm going to keep all my tarot stuff in here. I even made a little read to go with it. I might read it for you guys someday. But what I'm going to do is just start keeping a listing of all of the tarot readings for every period for you guys. And then when I do the New Year's ones, I can go over a summary of all that. And then we can talk about it together when I read your yearlies. Also, I got some skulls. I'm so excited. Like, this one is uh, Lapis Lazuli, and this one is Turquoise. The crystals. I have them. I actually have four crystals now, surprisingly. I only wanted these because they were skulls, too. And it was just like, oh, killing two birds with one s stone, but I still like an actual skull. But, you know, we can't have too many victims out there, or else everybody would be wanting a skull and shit, right? But those are my newest additions here. I'm not sure if I'll name them or if Malachite and Ditsy will want to occupy them. It's really up to them. But I figured they're nifty. Which is kind of crazy because when you look at it this way, it's like little death, starter up, adult, and then back to death again. Kind of a weird cycle right there, but I like it. Makes sense. Okay. So let's see, who are we reading for today, my dear, dear queerant? Someone who's just stolen on an offer. A um, little bit occupied with their own thoughts about possibly somebody else. We have the Knight of Pentacles right here, Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo. Okay. Hmm, that one just popped right up, right? Right. Also, if anyone wants a personal reading after I'm done with this, my email, Facebook, Instagram, we're all in the description box below. First reading is on the house. And I do accept tips and donations. Thank you very kindly. So, here we got the Nine of Wands right here and the Seven of Pentacles. Someone's putting up their defenses and trying to make a dream almost come true or being really sure about what it is they can create with the Seven of Pentacles, planting that flower in the desert. Like, using all their ability to make something happen with that, right? Thoughts and feelings are the Ace of Wands reverse. Possibly someone feels like something didn't start. You know? Because the tower was avoided. That's the root of the um, thoughts and feelings. You know? Huh. Something didn't happen because the tower was avoided. Okay. Let's see. So, choices gotta be made with the Two of Pentacles. Then we have the Four of Wands reverse. There might be a door closed on this querent right here. And now they gotta look at whatever options they can come up with to birth something with the Seven of Cups. A little bit of emotion. Maybe a little bit of creativity. Maybe a little bit of, you could be whatever you wanna be. You just gotta pick one, because it's not gonna be that door. But I feel like that's what they're trying to go for is the door, even though the door is closed. Could be with a Gemini, right? Oh. What is their vibration? Six of Cups reversed. They're taking something from the past as reference for the future. Whatever activities they decide to go on after all. Hmm. Interesting, interesting queerant. Let's see. It seems like they're it's like they're plotting something, but they don't want anybody to know, so that's why they're setting up a fence or whatever. Taking into consideration what their choices can be. When it comes to this, like, like definitely block door for me because they're trying to come up with new ideas on how to get in here, right? Like, you know, they're planting seeds down below. 
and up above they're got their guard going up and shit. It's like But the thoughts and feelings are weird because it's just like, you know, something didn't start and that's all because of the tower being reversed. The tower didn't come to be. Someone didn't either allow the tower or it just didn't come for this person. Maybe reality hasn't hit them yet. Maybe they're not really pay they might not even be paying attention to what's going on around them either. Everything could be crumbling and they could just be lost in like just whatever la la land you just want to come up with, right? Like head in the clouds, you know, on cloud nine, any of that shit. Whatever you take from such a personality as this, right? So let's see, Nine of Wands. Uh, this person doesn't have a lot of knowledge on what it is they're trying to do when it comes to putting a guard up. They might need to listen to their intuition about why things did not come together for them, why there was no chemistry or fusion. Um, right here, we got like Pisces energy and we have Sagittarius's energy. I feel like this person's like... They didn't tangibly know, but it's like they had an inkling that like something wasn't going to come together. You know? It was like in the back of their head. Like, I, I, like I, just, I just know something's going to be fucked up today. You know, it's one of those things, right? It's like they sensed it in the back of their head. It was just that little voice speaking some sense to them and they ignored it because it's just like that makes too much sense. You know? Or they're ignorant about something. One of the two, but it's hard to tell. I don't mean ignorant in a very sassy or insulting way. I mean, it literally, they have the Eight of Coins reverse insight, knowledge. There's something that they're very much unaware of. Or wasn't able to learn or could be refused to learn as well. Take your pick. But there's something they didn't know. But they did pick up intuitively that whatever the temperance was supposed to be did not happen. And someone's probably losing their patience. The Seven of Pentacles down here. We have the Ace of Wands, but it's upright. Huh. Well, that's confusing. Uh, I guess I'll just flip these two then. They were planting a seed of rule and success to start something... In order to end some calamity, this confusion, the stress, they wanted rule, they wanted success. Um, very shy, very um, holdy back with their emotions, too. Cancer's card energy. They got timid, shy, they want to end like, the distress and confusion. But they wanted a new start with some rule and success. It's like they were trying to plant something to create something successful here. Okay. Let us clarify more on the Nine of Swords. Well, this, they didn't know something, but they felt it. It was like their intuition was telling them something, but because their intuition wasn't giving them any in information that they didn't already know, and I think that's what this person was looking at, or what they were thinking, like, oh, I already know that, but fuck it, you know. They did, like they knew on intuition, but they didn't know for almost like hard facts. There wasn't like enough evidence or something to show for them, and that's why they had that wall. Um, well, it didn't do a damn thing for them, so there's that. Okay, um, they tried charging in, but they didn't get a victory. Um, they probably caused a lot of conflict without really looking for a reason to do so. In order to avoid the tower, okay, well that's here. Yeah, they got a little bit queen of swords, a little bit bitter, a little bit bitchy, a little bit inconsiderate. Hi, kitten. No, get off the table. Crazy. Hmm. They okay. So they acted crazy. To avoid a tower with somebody they weren't very healthy when they were like they like what people say toxic with each other which i absolutely hate using that word but it works 
And that's the unfortunate thing for me. But, um... That's what this relationship is. It's like neither the querent or their person in interest um, were really good for each other. At least this is how the querent's seen it, right? So now we got the Seven of Pentacles down here where they wanted... I think they wanted to start something new and get out of the conflict, but they were really shy and timid about it. Because they really didn't know what to do or where they were going. You know, I got a book right here. Um, they have a, uh, they had an idea, right? They had an idea, and that was to wait, because the emperor doesn't do shit, but party hardy. Wow, that's it. <laughs> that was interesting. Okay, that was different. Okay, let's see. So they didn't want to uh, really, they didn't know what to do or they decided not to do anything because it was like, they. I don't think they thought that through, this queer out, maybe. Maybe they didn't think that part through. No, so they waited. <laughs> so there that is, okay. That was pretty quick. All right, what else did you do, queer out? You got broken hearted. Well, damn, dude. Shit, why would you, man? I feel like this person just didn't know what to do, and it was, or, it's like, they didn't have anywhere else to go, but they decided to wait, and they waited so long they got heartbroken. Okay, you know what? No, I'm gonna ask for another one, please, because, like, like, where did that heartbreak stem from? That's the better question. Like, why are they heartbroken? Oh! Because they're not very, um... They're a little bit too immature for their age with the King of Wands reverse right here. He's kind of like a man -child. Very, um, judgmental, I always feel like. Very man-child-like. Always like, you know, it has to be his way or he throws a fucking fit. And then it's like having a five-year-old with, but with longer reaches with his arms and legs so he can actually do damage in whatever room he does if he gets close enough to shit. Because now he knows what he's doing. He's not like a toddler where they're still trying to figure out what fingers are. Right? He, this is a full-grown man just throwing a tantrum because he didn't get, like, a lollipop today. Even though he got one earlier that day. No. It had to be the strawberry one he noticed. Not the banana one. But that's beside the point. Just saying. The banana ones are cheaper. But that's what this is. And, he, and he's judging and very, very begrudging to um, the Seven of Cups right here. Um, Knight of Coins, Anchor Essence, this is not. This is like... What? This is like... Okay. Between him... They're thinking of options with somebody who isn't an anchor? Or doesn't... Or it doesn't stand with them, almost, I'd say. These cards are so interesting. I love the words that are on them. It's just wonderful, you know? Okay. Anyway, we're going to the thoughts and feelings and the roots of that shit, right? I don't know, man. Like, it seems like this person... I, I almost feel like they had a wrong idea about something. Probably, like, the devil. They could have been dealing with a Capricorn, Cancer, Leo, Sag, Aries, Gemini, Sagittarius. There's probably a few others I'm needing to call out, but I'm not thinking of it. Okay. Ace of Wands Reverse. That's got the Ace of Swords Reverse. Mm, mm, mm. Well, something didn't start because something was a bad idea. Which is kind of what I said earlier because they got an idea. But it was like, not it, it, powerful, dynamic. It was not. It did not, uh... It was not very enlightening, I will say that much. It did not work in someone's favor, because now this shit did not start with them. 
Um, it's like they're just now picking it up as a sage or a diviner. King of Cups, it's like they're coming into their wisdom all of a sudden. Hey, fat kitty. He just thundered in here after laying down just to run up to eat the bowl carefully. Um, turmoil and disorder not to be. Um, like they went, like they thought that they could come out of this disorder, but they had the wrong idea about how things were going to get started this way, I feel like. Like, they weren't prepared. Like, if something did start, uh, like, I'll say that. The two aces, yeah, I'll give it to them. Fuck it. Two right in, on top of each other, maybe that is the beginning, but it definitely was not the beginning that they were expecting. Uh, and all of a sudden, it's just like, there's no more conflict. So they did get possibly the piece they were looking for, but it wasn't in the way or the fashion that they believed it was supposed to go. So now the root of that, this tower reverse. What's up with this tower reverse right here? Shapeshifter, change, booty man card, knight of wands, someone rushing over here like someone's just changing their mind or whatever or looking at other options they can go about oh he's running away from all this shit okay running away from like what he does not want to reap and sow for not evolving that's kind of dramatic don't you think you know like what does that mean my guides enlighten me please all right so this Well, Saturn is coming back, what, the 12th or the 19th? One of those two things. I've already seen how he's been shaking shit up. Because he's been... He's suddenly very serious. He's just stretching it out. It's like he's nailed me twice. And it's just like, God damn it, man. Like, this time I didn't even mean to do it. I didn't mean to wear jeans. Um, to my orientation. I'm sorry. So now I gotta go apologize to the lady for doing that. <laughs> even though I didn't mean to. Gotta do it. Because... I'm tired of having this shit. It's little snappy things, oh, too. Oh. That's the insane thing. I'm getting very little things. Just transgressions like, you know better. But this person, I feel like... Mm. It's either them or the person they were dealing with that just took off, changed towards these options, and... Nothing was reaped because somebody did not transcend or evolve. That was why the tower was reversed. Someone just changed their fucking mind and ran to the options, it looks like. Okay. Let's clarify the thoughts and feelings and what the roots of them is. I'm not sure if I'm going to glue the skulls onto the glass or not because I don't know... Hmm. I haven't yet to decide. Oh well. Anyway. Thoughts and feelings. Let's clarify this. This beginning didn't happen the way they thought it was, but it did bring an end to conflict. Um, they had their strength held up. They kept their shit at, at a nice base. So it's just like, hey, okay, I've done this. I won. Whatever. Right? I guess they thought restricting themselves would open a door for wands again, except this time it's up right now. The door is just fucking closed. And now they're all sourpuss about it. Like, look at that. Queen of Cups reversed. Oh, God. She is mean mugging the past, too. That's kind of heavy. Like, what do you... Hmm. I don't like I don't like how she's looking at that shit. Like at all. Like it's really it is really aggressive. Like super duper aggressive towards the past. Like it's like a reference to something. I'm not sure what it is. Mind you, it could be Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Scorpio, I totally believe that could be you if someone just pissed you off the right way. Alright. Which you will. Like, I, I, I do not doubt. I do not. I do not doubt your abilities to be that guy. 
Let's see. All right. This tower reverse where someone jettisoned and nothing was reaped because nobody changed. Uh, excommunication. Maybe somebody uh, left the church. Maybe someone got a divorce or a relationship ended. Maybe just someone said, fuck the church, the pastor. I don't give a damn. Just left or whatever. Um, Hierophant. Could have been a teacher or a Taurus. Uh, communication with the star reaching out or switching one thing for another oh um maybe communication will come swiftly wait okay hold up mm. okay this queer it the person who took off really quickly, right? The querent was left with the um, separation with the hierophant, right? But then they want to communicate. Hopefully that quickly they can come back in from the cold. With Limpy Larry like coming behind them too because they can't just abandon him. Even though he is kind of annoying. Or they want their person to take them on as that role once again. Um, come out of some, like, maybe destitution when it comes to the finances as well. It's like they're trying to... Like, they want to reach out. They want to, like, get something going in order to get out of this predicament after the Hierophant Reverse came out, right? And they're willing to communicate about that, too. Like, I don't think it was the person who, like, took off, though. I think it's, like, the actual clearance here. So, let's see. Six of Cups Reverse. Someone's looking at the past and being all pissy like the Queen of Cups, right? Oh, Lord, they got a mouth about it, too. Uh, but someone did not fall from the bait or... Lore, magnetism, secrets, enigmas, they are not. Someone did not go for the bait of the mouth. Could be a Capricorn once again, somebody silly with. Someone! Okay. This person's pissed because I think a Capricorn didn't fall for their fucking mouthy shit. Because that's like the best way of describing that. Like, where someone knew that it was a lore to try to get in an argument with this person, and this. Queen of Cups right here is pissed about that because somebody figured it out before they did, I think. I think. that That's kind of... I don't know. That's kind of what I'm referencing right now. It feels like someone's mad that someone got figured out before they figured it out. It's like this person doesn't know how they tick or something. And this person managed to... Um, figure out that this was a bait and be like I'm not going for that shit you're crazy I'm stick I'm, I'm like I'm up I'm down here looking down at you or up here considering we're both reversed but you know that's beside the point lots of preserve and endurance or preservance or preservere Preservere, because it's stupid, right? I can't pronounce shit, I swear, when I first see it. Preservere and endure. Seven of Wands. Mmm. Yeah, this person knew... Like, this person knew how to... This person never went for the bait. They endured whatever it was this Queen of Cups was sending. Like, they just took it on the chin. It's just like, ah. It, it's like that thing I always say, you know, like, what people say and think about me is none of my fucking business. That's a motto everyone should take, because it, 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 I swear, it'll cut 98% of the bullshit in your life. It will. I promise. But it's like, that's what this person kind of, I feel like, had to do. This person from the past that they're now looking at, being all mad because this person was smarter than them. In some way or another. Not necessarily that they were completely smart. It's like, um... You know what happens when you watch people for a really long time and they never know that you're watching them? And then all of a sudden it's like they act surprised when you know them so well? Like a person who's really observant, right? 
a lot of people don't realize how much other people watch people. And if this person, like, knew this Queen of Cups really well, they already knew how they would deal with shit and react. Or maybe they just, like, I don't know. Or, this is this Queen of Cups being sour because somebody else put them through it and they had to endure all that shit, too. Maybe that's why she's upset as well. We'll see. So, next cards for this. Justice could be Libra. Someone might be getting their karma, their good karma, in order to just start something new. Okay. I still feel like this is the person that this queerance dealing with. Something that's actually fair. Or needing to work on some sort of fairness. Because a new start requires like equal give and take. And once again, Libra's right here as well, so it's shown up twice, so air sign could be in here. Hey, kitten, you totally, like, scared the shit out of me. Let's see. Oh, wrong deck. Moving on. Two of Pentacles. They're trying to make some choices. After they never made any choices, apparently. But, you know, it's never too late to see if you can change your fate or if you sealed it forever. Like, I always try to be optimistic, you know. That's the best way to go in life, right? They got the stamina and the potency to, you know, get shit done. They're, like, they're definitely looking for an open door. Four of Wands once again. Like, look at that doggy just howling like a wolf. You know, like, looking all sad and such. Always looking sad. They ain't got ain't no sunshine when she's gone, apparently. None. We got a little short book. We have a chariot. Entity channel. Eight of wands reverse. Exceed and surpass. It did not. And harmony and chemistry. Hmm. With like an angry mom just being like, you will eat at dinner. Do not resist me. And make sure you do your homework. She's got that look on her. She always looks like an angry mom, Karen Kitty type. You know? But it's like... It's like this person was in their full power, but they didn't take any action to bring this... Like, someone didn't get someone to come to dinner. You know? Like, someone didn't... Someone, like, was in their power, but they didn't try to change the uh, dynamic or the harmony and now mom's pissed so now they're trying to get creative with the three of coins Ooh, they're trying to think something up they're trying to hang on a little bit like like it work while they're not in their power right now to try to uh, come up with something that would work for them. You know, creativity and ability. Imagination, if you will. Four of Wands Reverse. There's a closed door here. What is this queer doing with it? I wonder. Gonna make a wish? Yay. Um, hmm. Well, I don't know how I feel about that. Mm. It's like they're wishing for something that isn't there. But still run into it. Like, just taking that bold action, that enterprising action. And, like, running to something that might not even be worth a damn just to fulfill a wish. With this closed door that's going on with them. Which I'm not sure is wise. I honestly don't think it's wise to go into something... You're not entirely 100% sure about, but I'm a Capricorn, so, you know. Uh, I need to turn my light on. Two seconds. It's getting dark in the house, and that shit just freaks me the fuck out, you know? But yeah, I don't know. Like, for me, it's like, if you're not 100% sure you're going to get some sort of valuable offer in this, like, I'm not sure, man. I guess you got to have a lot of hope and faith in it. Or something. Anyway, Seven of Cups. I hope for the best for you, Querent, though. Like, if you think you can change things and make a wish come true, 
Go for it. If you think you've made a mistake with another human being, just go for it. No one's gonna give you shit. If they give you shit, just send them my way and I will say really mean things about them. And we'll make fun of them together. I promise. Mwah. Okay. Seven of cups. <laughs> they are trying to birth an option out of all the ones around them. Because they got a broken heart. They got pain and grief. Probably over. Queen of Pentacles. So yeah, definitely could be Capricorn in this. Also, Taurus is here as well. I don't... It, did any other pentacles come up? I can't remember. Like, if they didn't... Well, yeah, the three of pentacles, of course. But not really. It's been mostly wands and cups. I mean, I mean, like... Well, yeah, there's seven of pentacles right here, too. Um, I don't know. A lot of this just feels very fiery. Some air. A lot of cups here, too. So someone's definitely in their emotions about it. I don't think this person... Like, they want to come back in from the cold, but I, but I don't feel like the money is what's really getting to them because, you know, like, they're thinking about running to what's not even here to gather in order to fulfill some sort of wish. So I don't think the money is that important. Here's the Hierophant again. Yeah, this person's all broken up, possibly, about separating with this fine queen who sits on the rock right here and that mentor sage no longer being such or maybe they made this person feel like they weren't worth the value or effort or what they believed was not good enough too that could be it too you know people be petty like bitches like that yeah all right two of pentacles you know oh look at this a lot of Pisces energy in this. Some secrets, and someone's aware of those secrets. A lot of Pisces energy in this. Also, Cancer. Like, wow. Like, that was like... Someone definitely know is aware of secrets, and somebody has some secrets. And someone isn't sure how to end up victorious in all of this either. They're really indecisive about the entire thing, so that's why they're looking at their options right here. Looking at their choices. That'd be a fucked up thing if it was about, like... Yeah. Was, uh, ah. I have to say, when the pentacles are here, this person has, like, a very um, interesting objective in mind. Like, they aren't focused that much on money, but whenever it comes up, it's always about what they get out of it, you know, like, what do I get out of it here with this fairness? What do I get out of it if I get out of this, uh, cold situation? How can I be creative with it and have my options with it, you know, like, this looks like shit, but this looks like an interesting place to go to fulfill a wish. It's almost like a narcissist who's, um, bouncing around trying to figure out who would be the best source of supply because everybody else is, like, fucking shot him off. Like, like they've been shut out or something like that. This is kind of what this period feels like a little bit to me. And it's like they're stuck um, in an in-between spot where they're not finding a, a source of supply. And they're just running to a really nasty choice just to fulfill the wish of having it. Alright. Two of Pentacles, right? They're trying to keep their stamina up because they don't have their happiness right now and they're trying to get creative about it still not sure what to think about everything or, or still hasn't come to a very good decision um king of swords right here Ooh, could be libra in here or gemini or aquarius of course um well pretty much everybody's on the freaking board so i don't even know if i need to say it anymore <laughs> but uh definitely looking to cut somebody down if they come up with some bullshit right being very honest, very truthful. That's not, or or they're or they're just confused about what the fuck they're fighting for. Yeah, you know, some people can be like that. <laughs> like this person's kind of like um, it's like they're unsure where they stand in their own truth, and it's like that's what's got them crooked. With the Ace of Swords reverse, once again, that idea is like what hindered a lot of things. It's like he's standing here ready with his sword of truth to stab a motherfucker who would, you know? And yet that sword is wavering because it didn't do its self-justice nor its owner, I will say. Alright, four of wands reverse, close the door. They're just running to whatever that'll fulfill a wish. 
like a narc, looking for any sort of supply they can feed off of really quick, right? Yeah. Yeah, because separation, possibly because of the third party situation. Ah, but they still want to try to offer a cup. So this could be the same as this Queen of Cups over here. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, right? They might still try to offer the cup very tentatively, even after all this shit. Or this is the new, or, or this is the new contestant that came in. That's what rocked everything, but I don't think so. Maybe they want to try to fix everything after the third party, but it's just like uh, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea if that's a, a really good idea. Anyway. Wait, okay, the Seven of Cups right here. Someone's trying to birth a new option out of all the options around them. Um, they got a lot of grief over Queen of Pentacles, who I feel like either got made... They might have excommunicated this bitch, honestly. They might have just thrown her out of fucking church. <laughs> this might be the bitch they threw out of fucking church. Let's see. Oh, they're really sad about doing that. Like, they're pretty upset about it. But they got the King of Wands over here that's just like judging and being all shitty faced to like the Seven of Cups right here, like not even giving it a chance. But it's like, you have the two cups behind you. Hell, you can even take the other cups behind you and get different kind of juice. Yeah, They're not taking the leap of faith. And that is going to be overwhelming for a while for the spirit. Mm, that sucks, man. So let's see what'll come up after. I'm still waiting for my after tarot deck. I'm so excited to get it. But I'm afraid I'm going to use my other decks way less, and that'll make me sad. Like, I don't want to be sad. Anyway, enough of my whining. Let's see what can come up after all of this. Oh, okay. Um, well, we got the lovers. Someone's going to heal from that shit and find a different kind of lover. Or what? Okay, someone's, someone's still cherishing this stuff like it's still going on. Or they're trying to move on to a different sort of love, right? Like, be victorious and all that shit, right? Move on to calmer waters. Oh, but here's a resurrection call from a knight of cups who's got a lot of sass in him to be asking for you guys to combine your fucking powers just so they can dance on some fucking turtles like a weirdo. Right? Just make all their dreams come true. But, you know, it's whatever. Man, that was a weird way of putting that, you guys. <laughs> like, I don't know. My guys have me saying so much weird shit anymore. Like, a lot of the times, I don't even think it's me saying it. But that makes me sound, like, way more crazier than what I actually am. So we're gonna tone that down. And just say, you know, they pop up when they do. Yeah, third party situation still going on. And, and someone wants to keep their guard up about that still, too. Nine of Wands. It's just like, oh, okay. Well, whatever. Uh, I think they're hoping the wheel will turn in their favor. And justice will be served as that wheel turns. And they're probably going to be all confused and shit. As they do. And, ooh. Mm. She showed up like at the almost like at the very beginning too. Queen of Swords reverse. Um, bitter scornful straight up pissed for no fucking reason other than the fact that she is now and everybody's a victim. Doesn't matter. It's too much ketchup on my hot dog. Boom, now your head's on the floor. I'll use that as ketchup. That's what she says, right? All mad because you didn't get that fucking offer. Which is like, ah, oh, you know? Uh, then wants to take a leap of faith. Trying to utilize what they did have that did not work. Hoping to get some reprieve. And that's where I'm going to end it, okay? Because this has already gone on long enough. I'm done. Like, I need to make dinner. Like, my husband will be home soon. But, 
that's the end of the reading, everybody. And thank you to everyone who watches and subs and gets readings from me. I need to remember to do that more often, and I never do, do I? I need to change that. Anyway, if you did enjoy this video, you may like, share, and subscribe if that's what you want to do. No pressure, of course, that's up to you, but I would greatly appreciate it, of course. I will see you guys later. You take it easy. Bye-bye.